What's up, guys? Welcome, Welcome back, back to our, our channel. channel. Today, we're going to be taking the baby to a very special place. We've been wanting to take her here forever, but unfortunately, it was closed on Monday, so we weren't able to take her. But we're not going to tell you exactly where it's at. You guys are going to have to wait to see until we get there. Right now, we're actually rushing because I have a dentist appointment at 12.30, and right now, it is 12.15. We'll see you guys there. we're back in the car now after my dentist appointment that didn't even happen wasted our time we could have been at our special location that we told you guys about wasted our gas acting like we got money to spend like that we're already gonna be on e but anyways we're about to pull up to the giveaway winner's house we got the bag right here hey. um george actually mapped it out and it says that it's seven minutes away from our current location so not that far um we might show you guys us giving him the bag we're gonna ask him first if he feels comfortable with us filming him and putting him in our video if not then we'll just record us handing it off to him all right guys so we just pulled up right here's adrian the giveaway winner what's up bro, what's up, bro? <laughs> hey, um, let's take out your bag over here Hi. 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 <laughs> so shy. i know i think a little shy girl you want to show him what it looks like I mean, hopefully you'll like it, man. Oh, it's still in the bag and everything. And uh, and there you actually got a sticker, so it might fall out the way you're holding the bag. It's in here? Yeah, there's a sticker in there. Oh, hey. Thanks, bro. Yeah, man, no problem, man. No, thank you for entering, man. And uh, your comment was like one of the best ones, too. You even like left the link in the comment, too. That was tight. Hey, look at that, you guys. Thanks, Vanessa. Thanks, baby. All right, so we're going to let him go right here. You enjoy that bag, right, man? Bro. Rock that shit. Thanks, bro. All right, later. <laughs> all right, guys, we're finally here. Look at all the fishes on the wall. All right, guys, well, we're here at the special place. Show them. Super fast. This, we save this for another video and we let the baby go home because it's really windy she's gonna get sick and we shouldn't do that to her let's go home yeah her little eyes are turning pink uh, i'm sorry you guys i have to go home just two windies for me so now we're finally back home after a long day of being outside in the wind yeah it was really windy as you guys can see from the previous videos your hair was getting all up in your mouth <laughs> i know my hair is tangled for sure but we're finally back home and I'm really upset that we didn't get to film or even really get to experience the park because for one, it was really packed. And not only that, but it's been really windy for the past couple of days here. And it was just way too much. And the baby, of course, I don't want her to get sick for sure. I know that if we filmed, um, the parents would have been looking at us like, what the, like, you know, like, what the hell? Like, why are you guys filming our kids? And then... There's some people that might have said something and me and George just didn't want to deal with that. And I didn't bring a baby a sweater because it felt warm when we left the when we left our house. But then once you were actually out there, you could feel the wind and 
it was just really bad but we promised that we're gonna go back and actually film a video there we're about to finally eat i'm hungry get baby hungry <laughs> yep you already know we have to make that quick stop to el grullo <laughs> i got myself some sopas if you don't know there's beans underneath i got my carne asada i got my tomato lettuce cheese and sour cream Put some rice and beans for the baby and then there's Vanessa's plate over here. She even added the little avocados. I know. And I good. didn't ask for that either. <laughs> You're being romantic. <laughs> uh -huh. Alright, little drinks right here. I know I never talked about it, but El Grillo is actually a business that my grandma started from scratch. She came over from Mexico way when she was 30 years old and she was born in 1933. I know there's like a little bit of a history story, so I'm not going to get way into it. But I they used to work there for three years. And I still go back from time to time to get some food for me and the family. And... I'm not gonna lie, not because it's family, but it's really good there. And they even have like the best horchata, right Vanessa? Or, or no, you don't agree? Well, it's because the thing about horchata, I'm not picky. I, I like it from basically everywhere unless it tastes really bad. And George is the picky one. He's the one that only likes it from his grandma's restaurant. It's but the best me, one, that's why. But me, I'll drink it literally anywhere. So it is really good though, but to me, I drink it anywhere. I swear, anywhere else is like I'll drink the horchata and then I can like taste the water in it. I don't know. I just don't like horchata if it tastes like really cinnamony, like cinnamony or whatever. I don't know how to say that word. Or if it has like a lot of grain in it, like that rice, like nasty stuff. But for sure, the horchata from the restaurant, George's grandma's restaurant, doesn't have like all that grain and like. Perfect. He said that he don't know where I'd be drinking it from, but if you guys drink horchata, you know that if you go to some Mexican restaurants, it has a lot of that brown, like, rice stuff. You know what? I think what you've been drinking is arroz con leche. No. <laughs> That's like grain no. tasting. If they have it because obviously when they make horchata, they put those cinnamon sticks. Yeah. And it's like, I don't know, that I rice. horchata? Yeah. I've never heard okay, of it. Okay, I don't know. This is like cut. All right, guys, with that being said, we're going to chill, eat, watch some TV. Yeah. And after all that, I know you guys won't be seeing it, but we're going to be behind the scenes working on the video, posting it for you guys. We're trying to be a lot more consistent, and it feels good actually going out and filming. I don't know, it's starting to feel like a, like a habit to us to just have the camera out and just do things with uh, me, the baby, and Vanessa. Say bye. All right, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Peace. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye.